Hey you, good morning. We are about to join the giraffe ride. Welcome back. It's good to be back. made it into the lock of the giraffe pride fairly early in the morning close to six and on the summer's days of course the lions will get less active as the morning progresses today is going to be another scorcher but luckily for us they're still in the open area a little bit Well, the pride male flicking his ears was of the flies, but something has caught his attention there towards the south. Could either be the Hercules or the Sumatra male. It does look like the lighter main guy. Ooh. One of the females with quite a full stomach. I was just saying maybe they did hunt something successfully during the night, something small. But the pride is separate. We did do a quick head count. There's only 10 of the individuals and one of the pride males. So the other 12 or 13 individuals could be somewhere else in this far southwestern sector that the giraffe pride occupies in the Timbavati Game Reserve. Coming to you from the central Timbavati Rockvik Safari Lodge. Check down in the description. There's some details of how to get here and who to contact to book. Treat yourself to a safari of a lifetime. You? How many hours do they sleep a day? These cats are highly lethargic, <laughs> up to 16 hours every day. Just like my university days in, <laughs> in the past. I'm also just saying they're in an open clearing momentarily, but as it gets warmer and the temperature increases on the summer's day they would move to the thicket adjacent to them A big 
cats can feel that the sun is getting a bit warmer edging closer to seven o'clock and the large pride male keeping an eye on the female they're following and they're gonna head into some thick brush over there between the terminalias and some of the magic quarry bushes in the area providing excellent shade What a beautiful specimen, him and his unrelated brother or coalition member, both born in 2012-2014 respectively, so both are in their prime, it's good, might as well be the very last time they propagate their genetics in the southwestern part of the reserve, but they've done well holding on to the giraffe bride despite all the pressures of nomads and other males in the area. A slight sprain there on the left front leg. Sometimes the lions do oversleep their legs, almost like feeling pins and needles. One of the young males that's probably just over a year old now. You can see how his mane is underdeveloped, but in development there beneath the throat. You may have copied there on the radio, the rest of the prize, the pride has in fact been relocated just down, down the road with some of the younger cubs being present. Well, let's see if we can reposition and go sit with the others. Do a total head count and see how many individuals is here today. In the shade of this tree there is a lioness that's busy suckling her cubs. Cubs that are close to about six months old. Getting some early breakfast before the rest of the day. Need two cubs busy suckling there on the four teats. After moving, some of the other individuals also started to move towards this side of the pride. The rest of the individuals are sleeping. The overall health and condition of the pride members are looking good. That was a nice smile, thank you. To the far northeast, the Vuyela brothers have been uh, establishing themselves with the Sark Breakaway Pride. I bet that these lions have been listening to the roars of the Vuyelas echoing down to the southwest, keeping their distance. Obviously, still with young cubs, younger than 14 months, they are quite vulnerable to the attack of other pride males or possible nomadic males moving into an area. What is the boisterous, playful behavior of the youngsters? Never gets old.
Now, always a pleasure to catch up with the giraffe pride and sharing that with you. Thanks again for watching. If you do enjoy these videos, like and subscribe, ring all the bells. Thank you for all the support during the last couple of weeks. I appreciate you guys. And on that note, from the Timavati Game Reserve, this is Christoph Skuman. I'll be sure to catch you next time. Stay safe and cheers for now.